Hey guys, today I'm going to tell you how you can make a base path for your lab. Firstly, let us know what is a base path. Base path is a highly concentrated alcoholic hydroxide solution which is used to clean organic contamination. Caution alert! The base paths are flammable and corrosive in nature. The base that we'll use to make a base bath is potassium hydroxide, which is corrosive to skin, have acute oral toxicity and can cause serious eye damage. On the other hand, the alcohol that we use is isopropanol, which is highly flammable, can cause serious eye irritation and having specific target organ toxicity. And also it can cause drowsiness and dizziness. Let us now dive into the steps for making a base bath. Firstly, fill the container with approximately 2 litres of deionized, that is distilled water. The best practice is for the DI water to be chilled. This will reduce the exothermic reaction produced when dissolving potassium hydroxide in water. Then, to the DI water, add 560 grams of potassium hydroxide pallets slowly. Do not add pallets all at once. Potassium hydroxide dissolving in water is exothermic and could overheat the solution. Stir slowly until all potassium hydroxide is dissolved. You must wait until the potassium hydroxide is clear and it has returned to room temperature. If you add hot potassium hydroxide to isopropanol, you can bring the isopropanol to boiling temperatures. Well, once the solution has cooled, add 8 liters of isopropyl alcohol and stir. And now your base bath is ready to use. At last but not the least, do not forget to clean and refill your base bath once every 6 months when the liquid becomes opaque in color or when you have noticed a decrease in the efficacy of the base bath. Happy cleaning! If you like this video and want some more content like this, then please like and subscribe my channel, Communicate. Thank you. See you next time.